Hey guys, Captain Dave Schneider, it's a guide's life coming to you from central Kentucky. Hey, I'm on the road again. Um, I spent uh, about five days, almost six days, uh, with Major Beeman, and we fished uh, Barkley Lake, we fished Kentucky Lake. Uh, we really just had an absolutely spectacular time. I love the Major. Uh, he's uh, a special dude, and, and I really appreciate him. I hope you guys enjoyed my vlog that I was able to get up when I, when I got here. Um, I did a little flag day thing out of cages. Of course, Major's a big part of the, the VFW, and I'm sorry, uh, the uh, uh, Legion post, um, uh, post 74, shout out to post 74. Um, he, uh, he has a, uh, uh, they had a big, they had a big flag day set up. I'm sorry, I'm stammering and taking too long here. But anyway, but you saw that video. I hope you enjoyed it. But that was the end of my vlogging. I, I, I have video, I have stuff I'm gonna put together, but I, I lost my ability to, to post. My phone didn't work. I couldn't, I could only get text messages once in a while. I was in some sort of Katie's Kentucky bis, abyss when it came to electronic uh, communications. Um, I mean, if I got into a McDonald's or something that had a Wi-Fi, I could, I could make a phone call and that kind of thing. But, um, and my problem was I was using Major's Wi-Fi, but uh, I think I burned up his Wi-Fi uh, uh, allotment on, uh, on a couple of uploads that I did. And uh, then I, I couldn't even, it wouldn't even run a video after that. So anyway, long story short, I'm coming to you. I haven't forgotten you. I'm traveling through the beautiful state of Kentucky. I will be in Michigan in about seven hours. I'll be in northern Michigan in about 10, 11 hours. And uh, Sunday, uh, tomorrow's Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to you guys that are dads. Um, if you Either way, if your dad's still with us, for goodness sakes, make sure you get a hold of him and, and tell him how much you appreciate him. If you have a hard time appreciating him, figure out a way to appreciate him. Uh, anyway, uh, uh, but tomorrow's Father's Day. And uh, <clears throat> but when I get to, when I get into Michigan tomorrow, I'm gonna try and get set up to vlog. I hope to have my my uh, Kentucky Lake Barkley Lake post uh, up on Sunday evening. Um, so two thumbs up on that. I'm looking forward to it. I had a lot of fun. I fished with uh, the grumpy old men, Mitch and uh, and Major Joe. Shout out to Andy Beeman. Andy is uh, Joe is one of Joe's uh, sons. Andy's on Lake Okeechobee as we speak, and he's going to be sending me pictures. He's going to give me a quick update on the conditions on Okeechobee. Um, I know that the rain's been pouring there every day, and uh, so I want, to, I want to get you a little update on Okeechobee as well. I'm going to come out of Andy's corner, uh, and uh, he's going to tell me how the fishing was, and, and we talked on the phone for uh, on, on Major's phone there for about for about 35 minutes last night. And uh, But I wanted to shout Andy out and, and, and say uh, that I appreciate it. And he's a darn good fisherman. He, he fishes out of a, a bass club that uh, has, is, is pretty well known in South Florida. Now, those boys, uh, some big sticks that come out of that bass club. And Andy Andy fishes there. And, and anyway, so shout out to all those guys as well. Uh, ben, uh, ben Whitaker, shout out to Ben Whitaker. I've got, uh, he's a young man I met at the IGA store. And I told him I was going to shout him out. He, I, he, we were talking a little bit there. I told him about the vlog. And uh, anyway, uh, Ben's a, a bit of a fishing enthusiast as well. So shout out to you, Benny. I appreciate it, brother. And uh, and anyway, but I'm headed to Michigan, uh, guys. I, words cannot express how much I enjoyed being in in this part of Kentucky. I've never been here. In, in a lot of ways, the Rolling Hills are a lot like Northern Michigan, Upper Northern Michigan. Um, but it's just gorgeous. And, and Kentucky Lake and Barkley Lake. It's unbelievable. The, the, there's so much of the lake that is federal land. It's just completely undeveloped. I mean, we're fishing and there's deer walking on the shorelines and up into the hills and, and turkey and, and, and coyotes and fox. And, and it's just amazing. And the it's just beautiful. It is, a, I, can, I can really understand. Those of you, shout out to everybody that, in that area that gets to fish Kentucky and Barkley Lake. I now understand why the FLW, of course, they're in Benton, Kentucky, but um, I now understand why uh, Kentucky Lake and Barkley Lake are such an important part of the uh, of the FLW, particularly the uh, the BFL, uh, the regionals and the All-Americans are held there. It's legit. The fishery is amazing. I think we caught fish every place we stopped. We didn't catch a lot of big ones. Uh, we, we played around and tried to get on some deep fish, but um, we kind of played the hand that was dealt. Uh, I had a couple of fellows that were with me that... Uh, uh, particularly one and one of the grumpy old men who he wanted to just bang that shoreline and we, you know what they caught fish we we did pretty good actually uh, we caught good numbers of fish every day um, some nice keepers i bet you the biggest bass i saw um, we put our hands on was three pounds uh, but there were a bunch of those too and it, it was just a great time um, 
but I, I'm looking forward to sharing all that with you. And 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 thanks for checking in on this video too, you guys. I, I hate to po I hate to post this way, especially because this phone has not been very good for me. Um, I'm apologizing right now if the voice is not in sync with the video. It drives me nuts. I, I've gone through the settings. I've called Samsung. Um, I, I, it's one of the reasons I may go away from Samsung phones. Um, I, I've been a huge Android fan. Oh, who cares? Uh, but anyway, I, I hope you can get through this thing. Uh, what else do I want to say? What else do I want to say? Oh, I've got a bunch of fewer questions, too, that I want to deal with. Guys asking me about rigs and what do you fish with exactly? How's that going? What are you doing? And, and what have you. Um, and I, I want to I touch base with all that stuff. Uh, real quick, there was somebody asked me about what rig we were using when the, when the, the two boys from Benton, Kentucky caught the... Caught, um, uh, Senko Susie and, and you know that 94 and, and the 712 7, the 712 was actually caught on a shiner but uh, the the big nine pounder was caught on that Senko rig I had a four I had a four might have been even a five aught uh, extra extra wide gap trocar heavy superline hook was using 50 pound braid with a uh, uh, with that big swivel uh, uh, bearing swivel you remember the vlog I had uh, I had about a 12 inch made just 10 12 inch uh, 20 pound fluorocarbon leader in that particular case and a weightless Senko man that was the rig we were throwing um, and uh, so that's I want to answer that question ask somebody specifically was asking me I was like ACHD something was the was the deal and I, I apologize for that but not remembering but but I but I'm gonna answer some viewer some vlogger uh, 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 some questions some guy uh, questions the next time I post here um, anyway guys I, I've talked 100 miles an hour longer than I probably need to my daughter's gonna holler at me for vlogging while I'm driving <laughs> Sorry, honey. I'm looking right at the road most of the time. Two hands on the wheel. Uh, but uh, anyway, and I obviously the uh, the got the travel got the uh, trailer all fixed, and it's uh, Ranger did a great job of getting me overnight me the parts. Joe and I got it put back together again, and, and everything's great. And I'm buzzing down the highway, so I'm very pleased. Anyway, listen, it's a guy's life. It's my life. Headed to Michigan. We're gonna start catching big smallmouth bass here in the next 24 to 36 hours. Captain Dave Schneider, thanks for checking in. We'll see you soon. <laughs>